Hey everyone, this is Rob Deer's blog and welcome to another reaction video series. So today's reaction video is going to be on the coronavirus outbreak and how it's affecting movie theaters around the world. And usually this is the part where I tell you guys, check out a few words from this channel, but this is a really serious video so I won't be doing that in this video. So instead I'll just jump straight to my reaction to the whole coronavirus outbreak and how it's affecting the movie theaters. Now, normally I don't do a lot of videos like this, like I don't normally do videos where I talk about real world issues or politics, but I only talk about it if it did affect the movie or the TV industry in some way, and in this case it definitely has. So as many of you have already known, there's been a virus outbreak called the coronavirus, and it has been affecting many people around the world, and because of this, a lot of movie theaters are closing down to avoid the virus from spreading any further. And because of this, a lot of movies that were set to be released in March all the way through June are being delayed because the movie theaters are closing down and a lot of people won't go to the movie theaters to check out these movies. So the following movies that's been delayed are Mulan, the live action version, and A Quiet Place Part 2, which were being released in March but have both been delayed due to the virus. And then you also have movies like the new James Bond movie, No Time to Die, and also there's Wonder Woman 1984 and the Black Widow movie, which were set to be released at a later date, but all of them have also been delayed due to the virus outbreak. So a lot of movies have been delayed due to the coronavirus, and it's unknown at this point whether or not these movies will be showing up in theaters in the near future or whether or not these movies would go straight to streaming services as a result. So I wanted to talk about how this would affect the channel as a whole. Well, as it stands, it doesn't really affect the channel that much. I'll still be talking about a lot of TV shows and movies. I'll still be doing my reviews 2.0 series. I'll still be doing the TV at the moment series. I'll still be doing the general discussion series. Those series will still be done in this channel during this time. However, the only parts of this channel that will be affected by this news is the in theater movie reviews and some of the reaction videos. Now regarding the in theater movie reviews, those are the reviews where I review movies that I've watched in theaters and I give out my quick thoughts about the films I watch in theaters. And because a lot of movie theaters have shut down, I can't watch the movies in theaters so that means that the in theater movie reviews will be put on hold for a while at least until the movie theaters open back up again and I can see a movie in theaters again and as for the reaction videos those might be affected if it involves movie trailers like I'm not sure if they're still releasing movie trailers at this point or not because of the virus outbreak so if there hasn't been a release of movie trailers for a while it's probably because of the virus so you probably won't be seeing a lot of reaction videos dealing with movie trailers for a while at this point but other than those two aspects of my channel that I usually do, the other aspects of my channel like TV at the moment and the Reviews 2.0 series won't be affected and I'll still be pushing out videos every week as much as I can. It's just that I won't be reviewing a lot of the newer movies because of the virus outbreak and because a lot of the movie theaters have closed down. So it'll be a while before I do any new movie reviews. But overall, that's the news that's going on with the coronavirus. A lot of movies have been delayed because of the virus, and a lot of movie theaters have closed down as a result of the virus. And it's unknown at this point whether or not the virus will go away or not, or what will happen in the near future. So I just hope that these movies find a place to play, and I hope that these movies still continue to do well. Even if they're not playing in movie theaters, maybe they could do well in streaming services and stuff like that. So... We have to wait to see where this is going to lead the movie industry and just how long the virus is going to last. So that's it for this video. And I have to say that this is a very shocking way to start the year. Like, I'm very worried about the people who are affected by the virus. And I hope everybody stays safe. I hope everybody keeps clean. I hope everybody stays indoors. I hope everybody takes proper precautions regarding this virus. And I hope that everybody stays informed about this virus because I really don't want to see any more people get affected by this virus. And I hope that everybody stays safe. So that's it for this video. This is Rabio's blog, and I'll see you guys later. And I hope everybody stays safe and keep clean and do whatever it takes to protect yourselves from this virus.